Hey guys, um, yeah, you are seeing right, you are seeing the Hot Wheels off-road fig rig and I have got three of them. This is a different kind of haul, um, it's just what I've been purchasing recently after watching a lot of race grooves, enjoying what he does with his cars and that sort of thing, uh, being a collector also. So, um, these I purchased in a local pound store and, well, pound store being the word, they were a pound each instead of normal retail price of 125 So in the UK here, we pick them up from anything between a pound and a pound fifty, I'd say. I don't know what it's like in the rest of the world or what that USD equivalent is roughly about anything between 175 and about 230 USD. So... I picked these up. Um, now I have got the red ones on long card and I've got these also on a short card for the yellow ones. Um, I'm looking forward to the blue ones that they've got, the H2, the Hot Wheels fig rig. Um, I think it's in the next, either in the G or H case. But yeah, I've got these. So let's just take these away and I'll show you what else I've been picking up. Now, as everybody knows, um, after watching Race Grooves, they've also had these in Hot Wheels over the last couple of years, the Angry Birds. So, this is the first time I actually saw them on the long card, and I decided, let's just pick them up. Um, a great little car, um, good for the track, but... Um, most of the stuff, sorry I should have said this before, most of the stuff I'll be showing in this video is for selling on later. And seeing as how this is on a long card, um, I know there's a few Ebayers with it. Um, as you know, kids open these things, so um, I've collected these just for selling on later on in the year. Um, yeah, so that's the Angry Birds. We also have, let's see these I've got this here this is a matchbox heroic rescue the Dodge Monaco police car um, again on long card we don't get a lot of long card uh, matchbox Hot Wheels in the UK and I saw these and I just thought grab them um, worth it again in the pound store so a great little deal. Um, I know on eBay they go from anything between three to ten pounds sometimes. Um, so I decided to pick these up. Um, good little find. They are a good little car, so I may even just keep one of them. I've got one on a different card, and um, these, as they're all on the same card, I may just sell them all off as a job lot. I'll see. Again, it's going to be a lot of this I'm putting away to the end of the year. Christmas sales were better. Um, I've been ticking over this year, so Christmas sales, are sh these should all go. These two I picked up again in a pound store. I was actually quite amazed I picked them up. This is the Star Trek USS Enterprise N1701. Now I've also got the battle damaged one here. As you can see it looks like there's a bit of damage there. Also on the top and this is the normal one. They have got the USS Vengeance. So um, I'm going to probably put them all together. If I can get it on a long card especially I will put them all together and sell them on. Again from the pound store so doing well. I know I can sell these for about £10 because it is the normal one and the battle damage version both on long card um, so let's let's start with Batman everybody loves Batman so I've got one two and three this is the Batman Batmobile um, on long card purchased these I think a pound pound 25 I'm not sure I bought them in two or three places all singles at the time never in a quantity but I purchased all three um, they've had numerous vehicles this year of which I'm about to show you but this is the long card version um, 
again surprised they're in the UK these ones so yeah pick these up three of these now we have let's start with these I've got one two and three this is the Batman Batmobile again all on the short card and as you can see I have got three of them not really I have more than I've got one more making four so yeah I've got four of these right now Let's see if we can get them all to stay up we'll get them all piled up to one side so that goes there next we have the bat pod if anybody remembers this in the Hot Wheels case these came together with that previous one the Batman Batmobile so I've got the one I've got the two I've got three and I've got number four there yeah next we have this again this Batman Batmobile this version but this time I've got them in the short card so I've got one I've got two and I've got three so I've got three of them recently the F case has come out in the UK so I've actually managed to get hold of the tumbler the camouflage version this um, again so I've grabbed them all every time I've seen them that's number two number three and number four if I could get another one of these versions of the Batmobile but in the short card it would make my day if it do, if I can I'm not really bothered but yeah that's my Batman collection of Hot Wheels again these are all for selling on later in the year once I get the complete set which is the classic Batmobile from the 60s um, they've changed it they've given it a bit of pinstriping so hopefully gonna pick up at least two or three um, as soon as these start becoming available in the retailers in the UK um, yeah just it's an easy buy, an easy sell to me. Um, everybody loves Batman, and as you know, that's that. Um, I also purchased a few of these. This is the Hot Wheels Fast Bed Hauler. It's a nice little truck. Um, yeah general retail price you all know pound pound 25 but I picked up all four that were there it's a nice little truck this actually moves if you watch race grooves um, video about this case which case is this in it doesn't really help on these short card versions of Hot Wheels I'm sure it's in the E or F case but yeah I got this so yeah I know these are selling well, um, again putting these away, once they start becoming a limited commodity I'll put them back up for sale. And this has been the one that I've been waiting for since Race Grooves did his video. Um, you probably know what's coming, but I've just picked up every one that I could find. If I can find more, I'll purchase them. I'm getting them ready so far. I'm going to hide them. I'm not going to show you right now. I'm just going to do the count. And as you can see, the count's gone into four, gone into five, gone into six. And this is number seven. Can you guess what it is? You're all in an airing. You must know after I've shown the fast bed hauler what was in. Um, the case race grooves did you might be able to see it there 20th century Fox can you see the detail there it's blurred out well now you know it's the Hot Wheels the Simpsons the Homer it's the car 
that Homer made for his brother Herbert in the cartoon Simpson series and the company went bust. Not a nice thing to do your billionaire brother but yeah I purchased every one that I could find so far. They've only just started coming out into the UK retailers and I've already managed to pick up seven. Um, I'm not sure it's going to be pretty hard for me to actually sell these on straight away. I may even wait a year or two. This is the classic. This is classic Dolt Homer. Where he makes one of the biggest mistakes of all time. And I believe this is not a dull moment for me. Because I know these um, will be big sellers. Europe. Anywhere outside the States after the way I know some people are pretty offended the way The Simpsons is portrayed in regards to just life and family life, how you should respect your parents, of which I do. It's just, um, it's an enjoyable cartoon and uh, yeah, this is going to be a great seller I believe and I'm trying to stock up on many of these as possible. Anyway guys, thank you for watching this haul and... Uh, this review of what I've been buying recently just as well as my Lego haul this is what I've been buying for Hot Wheels thank you for watching please comment rate and subscribe and I'll see you all later thank you